All right, I apologize again, you guys, for the video quality. But the update went through. I rebooted. Everything seems to be in working order. You can tell the widgets, like they said. Um, I'll scroll through. Sorry about being shaky. I'm trying to do this on my tablet here. Oh, I went into software, update about device, yep, Android 6.0 as you can see right there, 6.0.1, back out a little bit maybe it'll be clear. So far so good, everything seems to be working well. That update drained my battery a lot, but there's a few different things here I'll show you guys, try to go over with you guys real quick. Um, like I said, some of the apps are different. More around, you can see when I pulled the notifications down, they added this little bar here and when I go to adjust brightness you'll see it switches to the screen to show you that's a cool feature I dig that so that's working also after you get the update you're gonna have to go into the Play Store you can see my app drawer is different now too you see that it's white I don't know if I like it or not Personally, nah, I'd prefer it to be dark on the AMOLED, but no big deal. So, now you go into the Play Store, and it's just pretty much the same way. You look for my apps like that, and it'll show you, and you update. It, that way I got it on auto but one thing I did want to show you guys now when you go into Galaxy apps now look here you us I usually select here Galaxy apps and then it comes down it's not there anymore let me back out a little bit so you can see it says more right there you select that and now it says my apps see it says my apps you go into that and it brings that up all updates, wish lists, and the rest of that. That's different. But also you go into more and then there's your settings. You select settings. And see it's a little bit different. Auto update, Wi-Fi only. Those are on. Push notification. There's purchase protection. I've, I've never seen that before. That looks like a new feature. Uh, I currently have that off. And then for you, those of you who have Gear S2, which I've got Gear S2, so the, the Samsung Gear Manager, it's going to be the same thing when you go into this and open up the App Store. Now it says here Samsung Gear Apps, which you got to select. If you got the, the Gear S, you'll know that. And here's the app store and like I said it's usually like you select that and then it brings it down it's not there now it once again you come over here into more and then you'll see it again settings and my apps and just select my apps and you'll see it here again update all and all that right there is everything that you need to know so that's how you would update one thing I did notice I have my settings in my settings here underneath more settings my auto update apps was on but one of the things I did notice I, when I went here it didn't auto update my apps so I'm not sure if that's working or not so I come here and check this and then selected update and you're not going to see anything because I had like four apps here that come up and I already updated them so I'm not sure if that's something that's not working or if if that's 
maybe it'll catch later or something. But right for now, the auto update's not working. I know that. So you got to go in there manually. Should I do this? So manually check for the Galaxy App Store and the Samsung Gear Apps Store. For now, you have to check manually, like I said. Um, another cool feature here, I'm sure maybe you guys want to know, is when I come in here to storage. <laughs> I've been here once. It actually unmounted my chip when I come here. The first time I left it here, when I select this, went into it, the new feature that they have here, and sorry it's blurry you guys but when I did and I selected this went into it it was fine for a minute then all of a sudden it unmounted my SD chip that's there but I haven't had any other issues with it since I remounted it and rebooted so no other issues but everything looks pretty much the same through here with your settings and stuff. Um, let me check something here too, you guys. It'd be interesting to see. Yeah, that's still blue with the green and stuff like that. That doesn't look like anything here has changed. So I'll play more with it and let you guys know. But for now, everything seems to be working all right. Peace out.